Now is Asia. I told you we'll be coming to Kirkland today to do a very small haul. Um, just wanted you to follow. We're walking in now, so come on, let's go. Is it still recording? Just tell me to stop for a second. Good evening, everyone. I told y'all we'll come back to you on Friday, actually, uh, for a haul. So, sorry I am a day late, but I wanted to kind of get things together. I have a lot going on right now. I'll get into that with you on another video, but I'm just so weighed down um, with lupus. It just seems like you never, ever get enough uh, sleep. Um, I didn't go to bed till late last night, and... Um, woke up early this morning and went back to sleep. Genesis had to take her um, SATs today. So just had a long day just in general. But nevertheless, with further ado, did do the small Kirkland's haul. Watched a couple videos on last night as well. Um, so I told you guys to follow me into Kirkland. So now you're following me back into my home. Joann's also have the styrofoam type pumpkins they're already colored orange you can um go in and you can carve those out and you can reuse those either with the carvings uh, where you can put uh, a candle inside or a tea light and it illuminates or you can just leave them plain and right now they are 50 percent off i don't know if that goes throughout uh next week or if that sale ends this evening but just a heads up on that also. Now, I just want to show you this very, very small haul. I purchased this pumpkin here, and it'll go with the rest of the pumpkins that I have. Um, it's the glitter pumpkin that I have, and um, I kind of collect them, I guess you would say. That's why I said this is my little pumpkin patch. And um, this will be uh, used, of course, uh, throughout the year, and it was... $8.99 um, at Kirkland's and I did do the spin to win yesterday unfortunately I only had 5% off so I was terribly upset about that but this is one of the, the um, pumpkins they had there they had this in this orange color they had it in a chocolate brown with maybe a little golden glitter on top and they also had it in a um, I'm gonna say she said a silverish like color with a golden on top of that so they had that there. They had some acorns, bags of acorns, and just fall seasonal mix. You could always, of course, place that in a bowl and use that as fall decor throughout the fall season. Um, but then I thought about it. It was $7.99, and I really didn't want to spend $7.99 on that. I figured that I can either um, take a tour um, and pick some of that just out in the yard or whether I can... Um, get some of that um, at the dollar store. Um, uh, I have a friend that does a lot of the Dollar Tree haul. That's naturally D14, um, who does a lot of those. Um, my arm is kind of hurting again today, so you have to excuse me if you can see everything I have, all my goodies, but nevertheless here, um, and purchases as well. Um, from uh, Kirkland's yesterday. It has our family initial on it. Let's see. And for Cooper. That was really nice. Like I said, I collect pumpkins, as you can see, um, throughout the fall season because they can go um, up until, you know, we end the holiday season with um, Thanksgiving. And we'll, of course, then go right into the Christmas holiday. So that was this that I have. I thought it was really nice. You guys comment below and let me know what you think about that. It's really, really heavy as well. Mm. I don't want to put it outside at my door as a welcoming tool uh, because as well, um, it's ceramic. So it, it can be easily broken. I already have one out there that says welcome. Like I said, you guys, you know I can't um, see you. So, um, give me some love uh, with your comments below. Um, and can
count everything to my head and not to my heart. If something is done incorrectly or out of order, please forgive me. That's definitely not my intentions. So, you know, everybody has um, Facebook stalkers and um, YouTube stalkers. I've gotten a lot of reports back what, you know, this, that, and the other. But nevertheless, hello to you too, stalkers. Um, this is a door hanger I got for um, wreaths. I do wreaths all year round for every season. You'll see me with something. And this one here is just, mm, let me see, feel it. I think this would be the pumpkin one. And I think it's just an orange pumpkin there. Um, and we'll put this on one of the doors there. Can't really use it for my garage because it's always closed when you're entering into the um, other side of the house. So, but got this one for maybe a laundry room door. Um, if we entertain on the patio, um, we can put it on the patio door. Um, or on the pantry door. So there's several different doors in our home that this could go to and I have several reefs So we'll make it it'll fit right in place as well Because the other ones that I have I think I have one I show you on um, one of my hauls It was a green just fall leaf because they said they didn't have that one in stock the last time I went And this was the only one here in Columbus that was left But of course you can still order online as well um, This was another hmm, one that I had it looked like I bent it some kind of way but nevertheless to get the dress it just says um, happy fall y'all and it'll go with the wreath on the front entrance coming into the foyer where it says the uh, um, the wreath says happy fall y'all give you a close-up of that later when everything is completed and we do an entire uh, tour from the outside decor uh, until the um, until we reach inside the home so happy fall y'all and right here, I'm so ticked because it looks like I bent it some kind of way, but I can fix that. Uh, and let's see. Um, just trying to see what else I... Okay, yeah. These are the... Yeah. These are the other two items um, I received. That is this pumpkin here, and it has an easel on the back of that, so it can easily go indoor or outdoor. Um, I don't want it to warp um, outside, so if we have a family gathering and we need more on the foyer, I'll, I mean, I'm sorry, not in the foyer, but on the front porch. I may sit something out there, but I don't want to make it too cluttery. Um, so I'm just going to um, probably keep this one in the house there. And you can see all the little fun pieces it has on there. It has some bells and whistles and everything to that. So, and some glitter. You guys leave me comments and give me details because, you know, like I said, I wish I could see some of these things. That's why I'm holding off this bit for me now because you know I wish I really could enjoy them by me seeing them and I sometimes I just really can't enjoy them like I would like to and yes yeah, today I'm having one of those days and I just don't want to wallow into my you know stuff that I got going on here but you know it'll be okay I have good and bad days right now okay and some are better than others Maybe this is one of the other things that I purchased. Um, and I can't get to my dining room table because it was so heavy and I'm sitting low. So that's the reason why I'm filming here and not in my office or at the dining room, preferably. Um, and this is this one here. And it goes up from, you know, different sizes and they all have a little hay coming out. I know. Sorry for that little small interruption, but as I was saying, um, this also has the um, easel on the back of it and um, the little bells and whistles on here as well, the little small attraction, 
Kimmick and I went to um, get this and we went back and forth on um, getting it. But um, that's really it. I'm going to try to get pick up maybe one, two of the styrofoam pumpkins so that uh, they'll last throughout, you know, Thanksgiving versus trying to buy a, a real pumpkin and it not do me well sitting outside on the patio picking a little bit of rain here in Georgia. So nevertheless, ladies and gentlemen, tell me what you think about these things. Um, any comments, anything you would like to see get done. Um, I'll do that. I'm going to talk a little bit more now in depth on my next couple videos in reference to lupus and how it's affecting me. You know, I have, I'm very emotional a lot of the time, so, um, and I'm not working, so I've decided to do these, so I'll have, you know, a little bit more uh, time to get that off my chest without talking everybody in my house to pieces. So, nevertheless, you guys, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. You're all your subscriptions, all your views, keep them coming for me. I love the support. Thank you so much for tuning in today. If you like this video, please thumbs up. And if not, thumbs down. Let me know what I can do to better things. You guys be inspired today. Stay encouraged.